Wee! Welcome back to another Joystick Gremlin tutorial. Today we'll be talking about splitting axes. We'll walk through one example of splitting the Verpal Z axes on my pedals into two individual axes without a center. You can use any axes that has a center for this. We're just going to use my pedals as an example here. I'll select my Verpal rudder pedals and then the Z axes. From the drop down menu, select Split Axes. Click Add. We'll split one side into the slider and the other side of my axes into the dial of VJoy Device 1. There is a slider in the middle to adjust how much each axis goes into the split axes, but unless you have a specific use case for this, I would leave it at zero. Save the profile and activate the profile. Now when I move my Z axes, we can see that the slider in dial axes on VDOI device one move independently. We've effectively turned one axis into two individual axes on the virtual device. And just like with merged axes, we want to set any curves on the virtual device that we split to instead of the physical Z axis. Let's add some curves. Click on the VJoy Device 1 tab and select the slider. Add a response curve. Adjust the curve as necessary. Click on the dial and add a response curve. Again, adjust the curve as necessary. We can see when binding in game that each side of the Z axes bind into individual axes. Thanks for watching.